COVID-19 and the holidays look a little different this year. If you are planning to get together with your loved ones, WDRB's Monica Harkins explains why we are not out of the woods from the virus. For the first time in a long time, many families are headed back to the dinner table. But doctors I talk to say how to approach Thanksgiving depends on your specific family circumstances. I don't think that we can uh, live in absolute fear. Uh, we have vaccines now that, that work. Heading home for the holidays, but with COVID caution. Even if you are vaccinated, you have to be smart. Um, the vaccine does not prevent you from getting COVID. It prevents you very likely from getting as sick with COVID. Doctors say a Thanksgiving gathering for a group with all, if not mostly all, people vaccinated is the best way to prevent spreading COVID-19. So, Dr. Um, Stephanie Moore at U of L says it's too late for any kids to get vaccinated for the first time this weekend and be protected by Thanksgiving. But if the kids are the only ones still waiting to be vaccinated, the risks are low. If you are really worried, um, I know some families that are having, you know, people get tested um, before the gathering. Blue Water Diagnostic in Louisville says it has seen an uptick in testing and expects the most influx Monday. Dr. Rita Pardee with Baptist Health Hardin says there's still an option to mask. Even with people who are vaccinated, they can uh, still carry COVID and, and spread COVID and be asymptomatic and not have any illness side effects. So <clears throat> definitely unvaccinated folks still need to take the most protection. She says COVID cases are slightly declining, but now isn't the time to ruin progress, even if that means having hard conversations with your loved ones. People have their own beliefs and they have their own opinions about things. And certainly that's one of the pleasures of living in this country. I say the best you can do is try to explain it from a place that comes from the heart. A place of love as we reflect on all there is to be grateful for. What's important is our families, and we just had a year of not being able to be together. This is an extra special holiday. Both doctors agree it's always good practice to wash your hands and keep surfaces clean, as there's the cold and the flu to watch out for as well. In Louisville, Monica Harkins, WDRB News.